Hey guys, we're back here with Hayden Groats, and she's here to talk about Bike for Shelter, which is happening May 19th from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. at Community, Community Medical. You got it. So that's all that, but you work for Washington's Children's Shelter, and this yes. is your annual uh, fundraising event as well. Yep. So what can you tell us uh, about um, Washington's Children's Shelter? Yeah, first off, thanks for having us again. Um, for those of you that don't know, Watson Children's Shelter, we're an emergency shelter for children, infants of 14 years old, that have been removed from the home for various reasons, uh, many of which are abuse and neglect. Um, unfortunately, we've seen an increase um, of abuse and neglect across the state, and for that reason, um, our services are needed more than ever right now, um, which is why Bike for Shelter is so important to us. Um, this is one of our annual fundraisers for the shelter that help us to do all the fun things that we do with the kids. So, yeah. Great. And what kind of activities are you guys going to have at Bike for Shelter? Yeah. So, Bike for Shelter, um, we there's two bike rides. So, there's an 11-mile bike ride and a two-mile bike ride for little kids. Um, there's a big carnival. We'll have... Um, face painting, there's costume contests. Um, two things that I'm really excited about this year that are new are battle balls, Ooh. which is like those big uh, rubber balls that you put over yourself and run into your friends. <laughs> and then there's the bungee run where you strap up to bungees and you and your friends run as fast oh. as you can in the same direction. And yeah, bounce houses, um, you name it. We were gonna have a lot of it. pony rides. It's really wow. fun. Yeah, it's super fun. And a lot of this goes to good causes. Yes. Um, what is a Washington, I mean, you've been working with Washington's Children's Shelter for a couple of years now. Yes. And yep. what is a Washington Shelter, in your opinion, uh, brought to the community? What have we brought to the community? Um, well, we provide safe housing for children. Um, like I said, so, um, so often the children, there's problems at home or it's not safe for them to be at home and we're able to provide them a place to call home um, in the meantime and hopefully get them um, and their families help that they need and then reunite them with their families after that. So we do f all sorts of fun activities with them over the summer. Um, we get them enrolled in school. We take them to doctor's appointments, stuff like that. And so that's so many of the children. We've been full for the most part of five years. Wow. And we've got two houses. Um, one of them is on Buckhouse Lane. Um, that houses 16 children, and they're all school-aged. And then we've got our Fort House location, um, and that's got all of our little kids, and there's about eight kids that live there. So always full. We've got 24 kids now, so yeah. Yep. So uh, what, uh, what do you guys have an initial goal of how much you want to raise? Well, this event raises about 10% of our fundraising budget. So we fundraise um, over $600,000 every single year. So this is a big chunk of that. So wow. we encourage everybody from the community uh, to come out and support the event. It's awesome. Cool. Yeah. And um, a lot of this money goes to maintaining the Washington Children's Shelter? Um, it goes to um, doing activities with the children. Um, most of that is like, like summer, for example. Oh, yeah. We've got a super extensive summer program. We go on camping trips. Oh. To Glacier, we go um, to Virginia City, they do gold mining, um, swim lessons all summer long, um, things that many of the kids have never done before, um, and we try to give them those experiences while they're with us. So, yeah. So, uh, one, so let's let's talk about your website. Okay, uh, WashingtonChildrenShelter.org is where you can find more information about uh, Washington Children's and Shelter yep. and the 18th annual Bike for Shelter. Yes. We, uh, so you can register online until May 16th, um, and then you can register at the event. The price will increase, so make sure you do that beforehand. Um, and then there's volunteer opportunities on there. Um, you can read about all about our sponsors. Um, Montana Rail Link is our premier sponsor. Wow. They've been with us for 18 years. They do an awesome bar barbecue for us at the event, so make sure you come and eat uh, all the stuff that they make for us. Uh, yeah, we've got awesome supporters, so really fun event. Everybody should come out for it. Cool. Yeah. So um, once again, um, letting you guys know is that on May, 8, May 19th, which is a week from tomorrow, yes, is the Washington Children's Shelter Bike for Shelter yes. from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. Is there anything else you'd like to say? No, I think that's all. Just uh, hope to see you all there. All right. Thank cool. you for joining me. Thanks so much, Scott.